Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel Kitty Crossing. So today we are doing a how to sort of video. So I'll be showing you guys how to get villager photos and like the best way to achieve that. And yeah, let's get started. So let's start with the basics, like what is actually a villager photo? So obviously it's a picture as you can see behind me um, and a villager gives it to you after achieving a certain friendship level with a certain amount, amount of points and with these photos you can either hang them on a the wall or you can place it down which is different compared to the posters because as you can see now um, the posters can only go on the walls and um, also with the frames of the pictures you can customize that so these are the colour variations so there's natural wood which is the basic one and then there's the dark wood pastel white and as you can see it only needs one customization kit pop colourful silver and then finally gold so yeah you can make the frames look prettier and you get these photos um, after achieving a certain friendship level and your villagers give it to you as a sign that they love you I mean even if they don't give it to you they still love you you know so you might be thinking like what do I give my villagers how do I get these photos well we're gonna be talking about that now so the best way to achieve the friendship points is by giving your villagers items, presents. So I've got some items and I'll be talking about them whether they're good or not. So starting off with the clothing. So if you give your villagers something ugly, they will wear it and that's not good. And also um, the item has to be expensive in order to get an extra point and that items judge based on its resale value so the original value here is 2080 bells but then when i go to the next cranny to sell the item it is only worth 520 bells so that is what a resale um, price is the same goes for items and also they might display the items in the house so if you give them something ugly like I did to Marina, that's that's gonna be their house. I mean her house is literally trash. It's so sad. So the best thing to give your villagers is either fossils, fish, bugs or deep sea creatures because they have a resale value of um, over 250 bells. So I think that fossils are the best because um, villages don't display in their house and then yeah if you have a completed museum like I do then um, you can actually do something with your fossils and so having a resale value over 250 gives you a bonus point and now listen up just like Timmy and Tommy are right now um, you're gonna need wrapping paper so you go to the next cranny to get that and then you're gonna want to wrap your presents and then Annabelle will kindly demonstrate to us a conversation like how to give a present you know <laughs> so obviously you select that option here here's a gift or like oh do you want a present something like that whatever it is and you can only give one present a day so when you do give a present make sure it's something good so you won't be like Oh, now I have to wait another day to get a, another friendship point when you can get the picture earlier. And then here she is giving me a mic stand. Um, I'm not sure what like the actual percentages are, but um, most of the time it's clothing that they give you, then wallpaper, then an item. And also you cannot give money as a gift. So I'll be testing that out right now. So let me talk to Pearl. then do you want this and when I give her the 
money she is unhappy she says surely you can't be serious one does not give currency as a gift but darling it's frowned upon by whom you ask you're looking at her so we see she doesn't want the money i believe in early animal crossing new horizons game like in march april um you could give it money but um that glitch was patched up so you can't do that anymore and then here i'm gonna give her the assessed fossil and you'll see she is gonna love it look at that face that is a face full of joy and happiness and then as a gift back she gives me a yodel sweater I think to get a gift back, you do need to have the um, resale value over 250, so that kind of bonus point. And as another sort of bonus, I guess, um, they give you an item. So here Ursula gave me a breaker, and then when I gave the gift to Joey, he gave me a... Also, look at that smiley face, so cute. He gave me a dun 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 a lawn mower. My villagers want me to do all the work. You know, spring is coming up, the grass is gonna grow. They want me to care for it. Like I already do so much for this island and they want me to do even more. <laughs> not, not very nice. And then Marina gave me rim glasses, but you might be lucky and you could get a photo as I did right here. Everyone is so shocked. I actually didn't expect to get Julian's photo, so I wasn't recording at the sort of start of this clip, if that makes sense. And yeah, let me show you guys what the photo looks like. Even though you saw it at the beginning, I'm still going to show you. So here it is. This was when I first got it, so I was very excited. I'm going to keep Julian till March, because that's his birthday, and March is actually only a few days away oh my god time is going by so fast jeez the snow's ending <laughs> i'm so sure that i don't know why um but yeah another thing i wanted to mention is that you can get another photo which is jingles photo from the christmas event so if you don't ha have that and you want jingles photo you can time travel and yeah that's going to be it for this video i really hope you guys enjoyed and yeah maybe learn something because i learned something i learned that the resale value has to be over two thousand and fifty and yeah i'll see you guys in a future video remember to like and subscribe and maybe leave down a comment and yeah bye